Yeah, that's crazy. <laughs> and then if you need it higher, you just you see this knob, it's like increasing the height. It stops. It's actually increasing the height? Yeah, you didn't see that? And then you can do the front side too, wherever yeah. the knob is. I can't even find the knob. So this knob is dangerous, see? See, it went down. Oh. So if you're shorter, you can. So I'm taller, so I like that. That's mad. Yeah. It's always better to say that it's Bon appétit. This is our Airbnb right there. <laughs> this is where we've been staying all month. Love this thing, man. Definitely for love this. <laughs> I like this sleeveless towel look better. Damn. The like, 50 actually looks cool. No, I feel like, like the sleeveless towel because it has that wish shape. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I see. I see what you mean. Yeah, the, the, the exaggerated like shoulders. shoulders. Yeah. Yeah, this is more of like, it's like a straight cut. Yeah. It's like a 
That's nice though. It is, yeah. I mean, shit, it'd be perfect right now. <laughs> yeah. No, I really like this Dylan too. Yeah. How much is this? What'd you buy? What'd I buy? I got some. Let me unbox it. Huh? Should I, should I do an unboxing? Right here? Right now? Damn, no, it's too packed. But I got some uh, Rick, uh, what are they called? Pusher pants. Pusher pants. Yes, sir. And uh, I'm happy with the purchase, man. I was actually, I, I was, I wanted, I wanted to get them uh, at work. But uh, I couldn't because they sold out. So I'm happy to have found them. And uh, get a little 12% back once we, once we head back to Canada. So, good purchase. Not even, I'm chilling. <laughs> no, this jacket is nice though. Huh? For the winter. Crazy. You should do that. This rocket with like It looks crazy. Do this. Oh there it is. Oh shit. Do <laughs> it. vlogging here and there having some clips and stuff but never really had like a sit i guess a talking part of this thing um i'm just at the crib right now by myself it is currently fashion week it is day three it's been a hectic week um as you guys probably seen on like instagram and stuff greg and i are here for the month we're working abroad in paris for all of june so we've been enjoying the city a lot i'll definitely be showing some of the pieces that or the, the things that we've been doing through the vlog throughout the vlog um this is our third week here right now i know i haven't done any talking we've just been like living life doing shit all day so it's nice to have a bit of time to like sit down and stuff this morning uh we went to the jpg showroom at their headquarters beautiful space amazing garments there the team there was really nice to show us the upcoming collection that they're having um it's also really nice to see like in europe obviously there's like bigger brands and houses that have their headquarters here so you get to see how their work environment is and how everything is kind of all together in their headquarters like the couture uh department is like in the same building as the ready to wear department like the seamstress the the marketing team they all work there and so they're able to like kind of collaborate and just you know everything goes on in the same spot which is super cool uh yesterday i went to the undercover show which was amazing obviously a huge fan of 
undercover. I'm very grateful to get invited to the show. It was honestly an amazing collection. Some of the drape pieces, like the big hoods with the flowy material in the back that really creates that like nice poncho shape. Beautiful collection. The music was amazing. Um, it's this band from Australia, I think. I know June posted it on his Instagram, like where the brand, uh, the band is from. And like, I instantly added it on my Spotify because it's like a cool, like ex experimental, like alternative rock. And usually I'm not, a, I'm not the biggest like rock fan, but no, I really enjoyed the music. The soundtrack really made the show really special. And then I went to the Walter show um, by myself at 4.30. I mean, I guess the time doesn't really matter. Uh, it was outdoors which is super nice. Uh, the weather was nice. Um, yeah, all of a sudden it got hot. The, the weather here in Paris is kind of like up and down. So it's been a bit hectic, but hard to find like what to wear and stuff. And today your boy is going to the Yoji show. Yes, I am going to the Yoji show today. I am so excited. If you follow me from time, you know that Yoji is my favorite brand ever by far. If I had to wear only one brand, it would be Yoji. So to actually be able to go to the show is super exciting for me. I feel like it's still a little bit surreal for me to like be attending shows and stuff. And obviously being like in a very great position and yeah, just having the opportunity to do these cool things, um, being in Paris and stuff, it's definitely been amazing. So yeah, I have the Yoji show today. Super excited. Hopefully I get to film some stuff. I'm actually going to meet up with some of the buyers at Essence. Well, one of them before I go to the show. Just because, I don't know, usually I don't like pulling up to shows by myself. So it'll be nice to like go with someone I know. But thank you, June, for hooking it up. And then right after I have the 032C show, which is at 7. So a bit of a hectic evening. And then right after 032C uh, Essence, we have like the Ludan event tonight, which like some of our clients are going to be there. So I'm going to obviously see some of the clients, uh, grab a drink. It's like a little chill, like cocktail event. So that would be nice. And the price point is great. Yeah. Amazing. Thank you so much. I 
take your biggest size and like oh. these athletes are like even taller yeah. and bigger than you. Oh, so it's like it's for England or athletes. Yeah, yeah. 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 Oh yeah. Hey everyone, I'm back in Montreal. Just wanted to do a quick outro. Um, honestly, this Paris trip has been amazing. Being there for a month, you really get to enjoy and see how like everyday life in Paris really is and see how the city actually how it actually feels to live in the city. And I really do enjoy and love that city. Um, obviously, Fashion Week is always amazing. It's my first time going during uh, June, like the summertime. So that was a great experience. Um, definitely gonna start going in the summer as well as January from now on. Once again, thank you to all the PR agencies and um, all the PRs from the brands, Lucienne Pages, all the brands that invited me to go to their shows. I really appreciate it. Um, met a lot of great people, as always, during Fashion Week. So yeah, just honestly, extremely thankful and grateful for that month of experience, and hopefully I get to go to Paris soon again.